All right. Thank you for wanting to try Distill. I wanted to make this quick video to show you how I use the app myself and tell you a little bit of the motivation behind it so you can get a good idea of how to use it for yourself at the moment. So once you've installed the test flight, you can go ahead and open up the app. Uh, you can sign in with Apple. That's going to automatically create a new vault for you. And when you open the vault for the first time, it's going to ask you to set a password. Uh, Distill uses encrypted vaults. So if you want to add it to another device or restore from a backup online later, you're going to need that password. Uh, once you're in the app, the experience is very straightforward. You get a feed and you can start posting into it. I'm making some videos about this app today so I can share it with more people and I'm very excited for it. And that's pretty much all there is to getting started with the app. Uh, you can click on the month up at the top to switch between all of the different months of entries. Uh, you can swipe right from the left to show your agents and lists and settings. Uh, agents are a really important piece of digital because a large part of the goal behind this app is to bring out the best in you no matter how you choose to use this app. So setting up your agents well is an important part of making this effective. So to add an agent, you can simply click add and pick a personality that suits what you have in mind. You can click on the agent to pick their engagement style and goals. Um, relevant works for most agents because they're pretty good at figuring out when and where they should respond and giving them very specific goals is important to make them effective. So for example, Forge, the coaching agent, um, I've asked it to be a sim racing and fitness coach. And whenever I talk about those topics in my vault, uh, they respond in a helpful way. And that's pretty much all there is to the app so far. Uh, if you're trying this app today, you'll be able to try out all of the features I showed you at the moment. And in the near future, you'll be able to test out agents that can manage lists and do tasks in the background. A large part of the beta is about figuring out the right primitives. For example, in here, entries, threads, lists, and agents because I want this app to be flexible enough so that anyone can shape it however they want it to work for them. Pretty much everyone that uses this app uses it in slightly different ways. For example, I use it as a fitness coach. I use it to track and improve my ideas. I use it to track my goals and sort of have this thing pull me in, uh, towards acting in the direction that I want to go in. And a large part of sort of testing this out in the wild is to figure out all of the different things that people do want to use this for and making sure that the primitives are flexible enough to be for them to be able to shape it in the way they want to use it. Um, I'm very excited for you to try it and look forward to hearing from you.